SpaceX is ramping up like never before, racing forward with their sixth Starship flight, and it feels like we're on the brink of something historic. But here's the big question. What does SpaceX still need to fine-tune to get Starship ready for regular missions? If you've been following the latest updates, you might have noticed a curious detail some heat shield tiles are missing from the upcoming Starship. Strange, right? It's no mistake, it's all part of a larger plan, and today we're diving into why SpaceX is making these bold adjustments. And here's where it gets even more exciting. We finally have a launch date. November 18th is set for the next big flight, but there's so much more happening behind the scenes to make this possible. We'll take a close look at the launch pad's current state after that jaw-dropping Flight 5, explore the upgrades at Pad B, and talk about how SpaceX's next steps could completely redefine space travel as we know it. Even better, we finally have a confirmed launch date for Flight 6. Before we get into the juicy details of the mission itself, let's check in on the launch pad. And you won't believe the shape it's in after Flight 5. You might think the last booster catch left the launch tower in shambles, but it's actually looking pretty solid. The chopstick arms took a little wear and tear, but SpaceX's team is already on it. Other than a few touch-ups, the structure seems almost as ready as it was before the last launch. The speed of their recovery process is just incredible. And that's not all. Right next to the main launch pad, SpaceX is making lightning-fast progress on a second launch mount for Pad B. They're working on the concrete base, piping, and everything else needed to ramp up their launch frequency. Imagine two fully operational pads at Starbase, enabling a launch and landing routine that could turn Starship missions into regular events. That would be groundbreaking for both SpaceX and the entire space industry. Meanwhile, SpaceX's Hoppy prototype, that iconic first test vehicle, is back in the spotlight. They're giving it a fresh coat of paint and protective coatings, and rumor has it Hoppy might be open to the public soon. Have you hit the like button yet? Help us boost the YouTube algorithm by giving us a like. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss out. Many thanks for your amazing support. Think about it. People being able to get up close and personal with this historic piece of space tech. It's a reminder of just how far SpaceX has come and a chance for fans to see their favorite rockets up close. On the ground, SpaceX's tank farm is getting an upgrade as well. They've installed a cryocooler and are busy setting up more storage tanks, likely in preparation for the increased needs of Pad B. This expansion is essential for supporting faster launches, making Starbase look more like an actual spaceport with every improvement. Interestingly, they haven't done much with the old vertical tank area, which leaves us wondering if they're phasing it out or reserving it for something else. SpaceX's every move feels like part of a bigger strategic plan. Now let's shift to Ship 31. The engineering focus for this vehicle is all about the heat shield, and it's no small detail. For a Starship to return safely, the heat shield needs to handle extreme re-entry temperatures without flinching. Rather than replacing the whole shield, they've just swapped out a few problematic tiles and removed any extras they don't think they'll need. It's clear that SpaceX is learning from Flight 5's data to fine-tune Ship 31, especially around the flaps. The last flight revealed some vulnerabilities, particularly with flap hinges, so engineers are working hard to address those weak points. On the heels of Ship 31, there's Ship 33, which has passed a series of tests and is ready for engine installation. What's especially interesting here is that Ship 33 could be outfitted with either Raptor 2 or the slightly more advanced Raptor 2 dot 5 comma which has a lot in common with the upcoming Raptor 3 model. This flexibility allows SpaceX to push forward without waiting on the final touches for Raptor 3, keeping them on track without missing a beat. So, here it is. The moment we've all been waiting for. Flight 6 is officially scheduled for November 18th. With FAA clearance already in hand, this date looks set in stone. 
And with just a few weeks since Flight 5, SpaceX is really showing the world how fast they can turn these missions around. It's incredible to think about what this next launch could achieve, especially with each flight bringing SpaceX closer to perfecting Starship. On a different note, here's an interesting twist. We recently found out that the Fish and Wildlife Service, FWS, has been keeping a close eye on Starship, and not always through traditional channels. Instead of direct updates from SpaceX, FWS has been gathering info from fan communities like this one. Yes, they've actually been monitoring SpaceX news through fan channels and space-focused media. It's pretty amazing to think our community is helping keep federal agencies in the loop. But here's where things get a little controversial. The FWS was also consulting with some anti-Starship voices, which has raised some questions about impartiality. When agencies rely on potentially biased sources, it could shape their policies in unexpected ways. We're reaching out to FWS to get their perspective, so stay tuned. If we get a response, you'll hear it here first. With every new launch, SpaceX is charging toward a fully reusable rocket, a development that could unlock the door to deep space exploration. The journey hasn't been easy, and it's clear there are hurdles still to overcome. But the progress is steady, and the excitement is real. November 18th is shaping up to be another huge day in the Starship Saga, and who knows? This could be the launch that brings us one step closer to Mars. So mark your calendars, because Flight 6 is going to be one to remember. As we keep our eyes on the horizon, we can only imagine the thrilling launches and discoveries that lie ahead. And there you have it. SpaceX is once again setting the stage for something truly groundbreaking with Starship Flight 6. Missing heat shield tiles might seem like a big deal, but knowing SpaceX, there's always a method to the madness. This isn't just about getting from point A to point B, it's about rethinking every detail to make space travel faster, cheaper, and more efficient by taking this risk now, they're gathering valuable data to refine the Starship design for future missions, and ultimately, for Mars. With the clock ticking down to November 18th, the excitement is building. The Starbase launch pad is buzzing with activity, and SpaceX is proving that they're not just aiming for the stars, they're preparing to land there, time and time again. Why is this launch so important? Because every step, every decision, and every test brings us closer to a future where space travel is as routine as flying across the globe. Don't forget to hit that like button, smash subscribe for more jaw-dropping space updates, and join us as we embark on a cosmic journey like never before.